Hey BookTube, welcome to Barter Hordes. My name is Robert. Happy Friday. Um, for those of you who follow my channel regularly, uh, don't be freaked out by the title that this is my last Friday Reads video. It probably is my last Friday Reads video, um, but I'm not necessarily leaving BookTube. I have been frustrated with my channel for well over a year now, uh, actually. And it's not just because of the pandemic, although the pandemic obviously has played some part in my reaction to BookTube and other people's reactions to BookTube. But my channel is a little over three years old, three and a half years old. And for the first two years, two and a half years, I was growing at a pretty steady pace and maybe adding 750 to 1,000 new subscribers each year. Um, over the last 12 months, I've added fewer than 200 new subscribers. And in recent months, I'm actually losing subscribers overall. It kind of shocked me a little bit when I looked at the stats a few days ago and realized that for the last four weeks, I'm actually at a net loss for subscribers. And I've noticed that almost every single time I post a new video, I immediately lose another handful of new subscribers, even when I'm not talking about anything remotely controversial. So I'm not sure exactly what is up with my channel or with YouTube or with BookTube, but something's not right. Some of it may have to do with me splitting the BookTube Prize channel off into its own separate channel. My channel seems to have stalled since that point. And so maybe the growth in my channel before that split off was because of the BookTube Prize and not because of the content I was putting up. I don't know. But I'm not happy with the, the videos that I'm doing. I'm not happy with the Friday Reads lack of a format. Uh, it's kind of chatty, but it's not really substantive. It doesn't really go into anything in, in much detail. It's more of just, I'm alive. Here's what I did this week. And I don't think that's really too exciting for a lot of people. Some people like that format, but I don't think a lot of people do. One of the things that really surprised me when I looked back over the last year's worth of data and statistics is that my two top book-related videos over the last year were both ones I did back when I lived in Florida as part of my classics book club um, by a, a large factor. Now, maybe it's some high school classes who've decided that they can watch a 20 minute video and not have to read the book. I don't know, maybe I'm the new video spark notes for one class somewhere and that's got a lot of boost. Um, but my Friday Reads videos are really dying in terms of the number of people who watch them. I'm probably getting 40% of the views I was getting a year ago and of the people who are subscribed to my channel, fewer than 20% of them actually watch my videos. So I just don't understand what's going on. And it's a little bit frustrating for me. Uh, I was talking to some friends who are all booktubers too, and they asked me if I was enjoying it. And honestly, I'm not. I'm not enjoying the trends that I'm seeing. Um, and I know just looking at the numbers is silly and probably a bad thing to do for my own mental health, but it's impossible not to look at it when people leave your channel every time you post a new video. And so I'm a little frustrated with that. People have suggested I do more tags, I do more hauls, but I just don't enjoy doing those types of videos. I do kind of a version of book hauls for the BookTube prize because they're the books that publishers have submitted for entry into the next year's prize. But even those videos make me a little uncomfortable talking about books that I haven't read yet. Uh, I'm just essentially sharing with you the summaries that come from the publishers, which is not really rich content. Um, and so I'm not really happy doing those kinds of videos. And my Friday Reads has started to feel more like an obligation or a chore than something I look forward to every week. And that's not good, this is a hobby. Why am I doing it if it's not making me happy? Um, so I don't know if I, I, I should just do individual book reviews from now on, which I know aren't hugely popular, 
but at least I feel a little bit more satisfied with the, the richness of the content. If I should start doing more of my classics again and get back into classics, I've gotten away from reading classics as the Book 2 Prize has exploded because I feel obligated to read as many of those books as possible. And that's not even going to be possible next year when we go to a third division. So I should just give up on that vanity. Um, as Kazen used tells me regularly I need to get off the completionist train, the completest train, I think is what she calls it. Um, I have thought about going back to doing some more thematic videos where I pick a theme like family. Right now I'm reading some books that are all focused on the family. Maybe I should do a video on four or five of those books together when I finish reading that selection. They're not all new releases. Some of them are pretty old, but that might be something I should do. The thing that that will necessitate, however, is me giving up on a specific day uh, for filming every week. I won't have the same kind of regular schedule for videos. I'll be filming whenever I have something to say, which may not be as often. It probably won't be as often because I don't read that fast. Um, so I wanted you to know that I'm not giving up on BookTube. But I'm not happy with the direction that my channel is, is going in and the reaction to my channel has not been encouraging and positive. There's, there's a real good community of people who comment regularly on my videos and I'm so grateful for them and their support, but they're becoming smaller and smaller each month. And so that is a trend that I, I can't just ignore. It's hard for me to just look at the numbers and say, oh, those don't mean anything. Well, they mean something. I'm just not sure what. So I am going to try to salvage my channel somehow by going in a counterintuitive direction and by focusing more on content and less on what everybody else is doing uh, because it's not really working for me. Uh, it might be my age. It might be my attitude towards reading. I don't know, but that kind of direction doesn't really excite me about making videos. So I'm going to try to try a couple of different directions. I mentioned to you a couple of weeks ago, I may try a short story series. I've been giving that more thought. Um, so stick with me. Um, we will be having a big announcement video on the BookTube Prize channel on Monday, Memorial Day here in the United States, where we announce the results from the quarterfinals and the pairings for the semifinals. So please mark that on your calendar. And if you're not already subscribed to the BookTube Prize channel, just from a purely, purely practical point of view, please do subscribe to that channel because the more subscribers that channel has, there are some publishers, that's the first thing they look at is how many subscribers the channel has, whether they're going to pay attention to it when I request a review copy or something like that. So please do subscribe to that channel, even though there aren't a lot of videos every month for you to watch. Just having the subscriber count makes a difference to the publishing world. Um, so I'm going to try to do some things to change the direction of my channel without abandoning my channel. Um, most of the books I read, I post relatively brief reviews on both Goodreads and on Instagram already. It seems kind of redundant to do the same review again here. So I'm going to try to do something a little bit different here than I do on my Instagram account or on my Goodreads account, either one. So if you have any great ideas, I'm glad to listen. Some of them I'll probably take on. Some of them I'll probably not take on because they just don't sound right for me. Please don't be offended if I don't adopt your idea. It's nothing personal. I'm just stubborn. Uh, I know that about myself. And if something doesn't feel right, I'm not going to want to do it. And especially for something where I don't have to make videos, but I enjoy being part of this community and want to, that to continue. So not a downer video. I don't mean it that way. I'm just not happy with the direction my channel is going and it's time to make a change. I'm just not sure exactly what direction that new change will be. So stick with me and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye everybody.